I was thinking about explaining my students how uh, the marking criteria works and uh, how to read the assessment brief. Uh, most of the time when uh, they sit an exam, uh, I'm not sure they really understand what we are asking them to do. Okay? And the reason why we have chosen these cards uh, and uh, the domino is because uh, when uh, you play cards, uh, you have some rules uh, that you have to follow in order to, to win the game. And if you don't follow them, obviously you won't win. So it's really important for them to understand what we are asking them. Um, what I am planning to do uh, is uh, to uh, put them into groups uh, so that they can read, uh, first of all, uh, the marking criteria and ask them questions to see what they actually uh, get from them, what is the interpretation of the marking criteria. And then after that, I also uh, I will also present them some uh, assignments made by previous students, uh, obviously anonymous uh, and with no marks on, on them. And what they will need to do is actually to uh, mark the assignment themselves uh, and try to guess uh, what mark uh, has been given to, uh, to each assignment. Uh, and hopefully this will uh, not only help them uh, to uh, give uh, a feedback to each other, uh, but also hopefully will help them to understand uh, how to read the marking criteria and how to apply them when uh, they do the exam.